All right, we're back on another adventure, you guys, and we're doing it a little bit different this time. We're staying at an old cabin. This cabin is from 1908. That's when it was built by an old ranger, forest ranger, I believe. Check it out, come on inside. Here we are. This is where you enter. Guess this would be the living room. We do have power in the cabin and it's heated by a furnace. Um, so I know originally they would have had probably a fireplace probably right here, maybe. All right, then to the right, we have a bedroom right here. I'm not sure if this was originally a bedroom and I'm, I'm sure this is probably a closet. Okay, here's the furnace. There's the furnace. Look at these light switches. What is this? <laughs> Man. All right, and here is the man himself who built the cabin. Granville Granny Gordon. And his wife, Pauline Gordon. I think they had a couple of kids. He either had two or three kids, I'm not sure. But they lived here, this was their house. Pretty crazy, actually. All right, so then through here, this is where all the magic happens. The kitchen. Oh yeah, we even have an oven, an electric oven. And I've got a really good meal to cook tonight. A really good one. I told you guys, I was gonna make it up to you from the last video. There's the kitchen table. We've got a hutch of some sort over here. I think there's like plates and stuff in here. Oh yeah. One thing is, is we do not have running water. So we will have to clean everything with just jugs of water, I guess. Which isn't no big deal. Okay, so then around this side, we have a fridge. We actually have a fridge in here. Did they leave us anything good? Empty. And it looks like kind of like a utility closet. Maybe that's where they put all the stuff to clean. And then to the right is the stairway to go upstairs. Let's see if we can turn this light on. Oh yeah, there we go. So we'll climb the stairs. Yeah, 1908. It's crazy to think about. bedroom I guess oh beautiful view out that way I can't get over how awesome it is out here we've got another bedroom here and lots of flies <laughs> it looks like there's a lot of bugs around here oh yeah we got bugs all over the place nice I'll have to clean those guys up and we've got another bedroom right here Man, look how beautiful it is out there. Ah, oh, gorgeous. Just gorgeous. I'm not sure if I can clean those windows. I think that's on the outside. I'm not sure what this is. Maybe a closet? Yep. Looks like a closet to me. That's obviously an old switch right there, so I don't know how old this electrical is or when it was put in, but quite fascinating, really. All right, let's go back downstairs. Oh, wow. This is awesome. Man, what a beautiful view right off your back porch. That's what I'm talking about. So we're actually out in Montana right now. And I wanna say these are the Cabinet Mountains. I'm not 100% sure, um, but it's gorgeous. All right, so now we just gotta bring everything inside and get everything situated. Oh, I can hear the furnace. Furnace started up.
You know what? I think over here is the outhouse. So let's go see that real quick. Man, I can't get in there. I'm gonna have to find a way in there somehow, right? <laughs> Hopefully I can get to the river through this way. I can hear it, but... Oh man, there's so many tracks out here. I think this is the place to put the trail cam tonight, for sure. At least I'm gonna try it in the woods. So I think that the river's just right over here. I don't think it's a huge one, but it's something to look at. Look at that. Man, that's gorgeous up there. Look at the mountains. Oh, there's another little creek right here coming into this one. Man, this is pretty. This is beautiful little river right here. Oh, wow. You guys see that? There's a deer right there. Right in the water, he's crossing it. Oh, man. <laughs> that is awesome. I'm gonna follow him for a little bit here. Try not to scare him too much. Cool. And I think that's one of the first times I've ever done that. That was super cool. Wow. All right, so I'm gonna follow my way out of here and we're gonna put up the trail cam somewhere out here. Okay, so there's the cabin. What if I just put it like right in here? Okay, got the trail cam. Right here maybe. 
right here. This looks like a good spot. It's kind of hidden. We're gonna go ahead and turn it on. So it's in there on that tree. And I'm kind of hoping that maybe something comes around in here and walks that way, I don't know. Well, it's worth a shot. I don't know. We'll see what happens tonight. All right, I'm gonna turn it on real quick and just see what the picture looks like sitting right there. So there it is. So it's four o'clock right now. The sun is getting ready to go down here in a minute. We'll uh, get back to, to the cabin and hopefully tonight we'll catch something on the trail cam. Now I'm not really sure why this is on the wall. It looks like really old newspaper from a long time ago. But it's very interesting to read and see. It's really cool. Maybe it kind of helped with the draft or something. I don't know. It's just really interesting. All right, it's about that time. It's time to make some delicious dinner. Let's do it. Oh yeah, dinner is in the oven and we are cooking you guys. It's gonna be a little bit though, but it's gonna be delicious. I'm not sure what's in here. Well, I guess we'll take a look. Okay, we've got some glasses, I guess, if you forgot them. Maybe some games. Cards, of course, you need cards. 
crayons, maps. Oh yeah, see? Cabinet Mountain Wilderness. I was right. Pick up sticks. Maybe I'll have to play that one. <laughs> Bow River Ranger Station Journal. Okay, let's look at those. October 28th through November 2nd, 2021. I am back. I can't believe it's been three years since I was here last. I am glad that not much has changed other than the years of journals that are now gone. I hope they are in good hands. I am glad that I took photos of my father's and grandfather's entries. Rest in peace. On December 9th, 1920, there was a blizzard. My great-grandmother went into labor. She was brought here in a horse-drawn sleigh and gave birth to my grandpa upstairs in the corner. <laughs> this ranger station was still being operated as such at that time. Wow, that's really cool. When I was first brought here and told of this, it was an empty and non-rented shell. I took photos and will bring copies to leave with my next entry. Every time I'm here, I feel blessed to have this one more time of peace, serenity, and opportunity to unplug from society. Enjoy one another. Enjoy nature. Thank you to all who have helped to keep this ranger station alive and well for the generations of my family to enjoy. Wow, that's really cool. That's like a little piece of history right there. I couldn't imagine that. I mean, just sitting here, it's just so weird. There's one more journal entry here that I wanted to read. This one was kind of cool too to think about. I can just imagine her picking tons of apples for apple pie, dumplings, and sauce. I can see her working in the garden, keeping house and helping with all the chores. I look out the windows at all the amazing views that are constantly changing with the seasons and think how blessed they were to live here. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, that's just kind of cool to look at some of these. Man, thinking about people that live in here. Well, I just heard the oven. Better go check the food. Okay, okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, look at that. Look at that. Oh, man, that's looking good. Okay, we're good there. Curious about these potatoes. Dearly yeah, Father, Lord, thank you so much for this time, Lord. I thank you for this beautiful place that I'm at, Lord, this cabin. Um, Lord, the history here. And I just thank you for the men and women, Lord, that came before us, that paved the way. I pray that you will just bless this food to my body. Be with me tonight. Help me to get good rest. I pray that you will also be with the family as I'm away. I thank you and love you. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Alrighty. It is time to dig in. Look at that. That thing looks juicy. Like super juicy. Oh, I should probably take this off. My little foil. Truss. Oh, nice and juicy. Oh, that's juicy. Oh, that's really juicy. That is really good. That is a gourmet meal right there.
dinner was awesome. That was a gourmet meal for sure. Makes me wonder too if they ever had a meal like that in here. I'm sure they had to have. I mean, chicken, veggies, it's kind of a staple. <laughs> I'm sure they had amazing meals in here. Well, now that I'm stuffed, it's time to just relax, hang out for a bit, and then get ready for bed. Pick up sticks. Man, this bed is firm. <laughs> Hopefully I sleep good tonight. Uh, I'm, I'm sure I will actually. It was a long day, very long day of driving and then uh, just doing stuff around here. So hopefully I'll get a good night's sleep. I have a feeling that I'll be woken up by one of those little stink bugs though. They're everywhere. There's one right there, I see them. They're crawling all over the place. Oh well, it's just what you gotta deal with, you know? No different than camping out in a tent, I guess. <laughs> oh, all right guys, that's it for me tonight. I will see you guys in the morning. Oh yeah. Hopefully I get some good sleep.
Oh, hey, boy. What you got there, boy? The paper? Oh, you're the best. Oh, coffee in the morning is a must. <laughs> well, good morning, everybody. I didn't sleep too bad last night. I was actually really comfortable. I heard a little bit of the, uh, the stink bugs flying around, but, and then the furnace would kick on. But other than that, I slept really good. Nice and comfortable little bed up there. I've got a good meal in the oven right now. Hash browns, eggs, oh. I forgot the cheese though. That's okay. Still gonna be good. Oh, that's good. You know, sitting in these seats each and every one of them just makes me feel, I don't know, like I'm looking into the past a little bit. With every spot that you sit, you see different things. You can look out the windows and it just makes you wonder what, what the other people were looking at or what were they thinking when they were sitting here? I don't know. There's just something about it. Looking through these old windows, looking out in the scenery, and just knowing that somebody else was standing here or looking out this window a long time ago. It's really, it's really so amazing. It really is. I can't get over it.
in case you're wondering, breakfast was awesome. <laughs> All right, now we need to go uh, retrieve that trail cam and then we're gonna have to get back here, clean up real quick and get out of here. The time at the cabin's coming to an end. See if we caught anything. Is it still alive? Maybe it died. No? Okay, there's me. And that don't look like anything else. Nothing, you guys. We'll get one someday, you guys. Someday. That cabin is just so cool to look at, you guys. Out here in the beautiful Montana wilderness. <laughs> All right, that's gonna be it for the video, you guys. I've gotta clean up, pack up, and I've got a big old drive ahead of me. So like always, thank you so much for watching. God bless, and I'll see you on the next adventure. Bye! Well, you always got to leave a tip. <laughs>